Hello, hello, and welcome back to another edition of To Quota and Beyond. And in today's video, I'm going to be going through how to quickly find verified emails when you're on LinkedIn. So the use case of this might be that you've just found out that somebody has left a company, somebody new has come in and they're a decision maker that you don't want to reach out to, but they're not yet in your CRM, or you just don't want to spend the time going through databases like Zoom Info to find the information, or it might not be up to date. Let's take an example that they've just moved into a new role and you want to send an email to them. So LinkedIn is your friend when it comes to finding people with their most up-to-date career history. And what I'm going to show you today is a tool called Get Prospect, which allows you to view somebody's profile click a button and then get their uh, email address. So let's just go in for a quick example. I'm going to use my co-founder's email uh, profile. As you can see here, we've got Get Prospect. This is the actual Chrome extension that we're using. And um, it gives you a little bit of a warning that you can't find the email address from a from the home page or the, the search results page. It does work on the LinkedIn search results though. And it also works in LinkedIn Sales Navigator. So let me just go and show you what it looks like when you're on an actual profile. So here I'm on Jakob's profile and it's already pulling up the information about Jakob here. It's pulling through that he works to speak on podcasts. It's not always 100% perfect because some people might have more uh, details here in their experience, but for Jakob, it's looking like it's working. So now I'm just gonna uh, make sure that I'm saving it to the right list. One word of caution if you're using lists that are then going to trigger some automatic emails I would always recommend not doing that and making sure that you go through your list and just double check that it's got, you've got the right email address for the person. Sometimes the emails that they find are for an old company or maybe they're personal as well. So never automate it just from this. I've learned the, that mistake the hard way. And um, so I'm gonna select that list and then I'm gonna say save and show email. Um, so that is now validating email. So one of the reasons why I like Get Prospect more than some of the other tools like Snob or Seamless Whilst they do offer verified emails, I've always found Get Prospect to be a much better uh, way of verifying emails. So this can take some time. Um, and what you'll see is that it will go into your Get Prospect uh, screen. Now, Get Prospect is a, a really, they've updated their software. It's a really clean uh, experience. And as you can see, I have found a verified email and the mail server speak on podcast.com confirm that email exists. So I can just simply copy that now and then go into my email, whether that be my email client or into my outbound sequencing tool, and I can start a sequence or just send an email to Jakob. Let me just quickly show you what the search results look like. So I'm just gonna search for CMO, and um, let me just see if I go all people results. And what will happen now is that it's automatically selected all 10 of the profiles that are here. Now that might be a little bit hit and miss. Obviously you'd want to make sure that you go through your filters and filter that, uh, that number down. But once you have filtered that search, you can simply just export everything from the pages. One thing to keep in mind is that LinkedIn is always looking for tools like this. So make sure that you don't abuse it and do too many in terms of volume. But hopefully that's helpful. If you want more technical tips, uh, let me know. If you want more tips like this, um, also, let me know. And if there's a specific tool or thing that you're struggling with, do um, get in touch with me and I'm more than happy to record a video for you. All right. Take care.